Greg. I seen Rockman, Jake Paul off due to the weight situation. Yeah. What's your thoughts on it? I'm at 200 right now. He should have just called me. Look, man, it ain't hard to reach out to him. Greg. I'm at 200 right now. Greg will beat the shit out of Jake Paul. <laughs> Rockman, rock rock for some reason, he couldn't make hey. it. You know what I mean? I understand because he is a heavyweight. Um, Jake Paul, he trying to pick and choose. I'm the perfect opponent. I'm 5'6". I'm uh, ain't 200 pounds car. right now, even. Um, so I'm willing to wait. I'll even come in under if you want me to. I'll take um, Greg to the weigh-in Friday. And then, you know, whatever they want to do, <laughs> we can do it. Jake Paul, bitch, though. We're right. He be, he be picking and choosing. And he playing around. And he trying to do this and do that. He listening to people now. He done fucked the whole car up. Instead of just accepting the fight, yeah, just letting it be what it was. Yeah, yeah. Hey, yo, bed. it was it was a lot of good fighters on that card. You had Brandon Lee fighting on the card, a yeah. uh, kid named Demontez Duncan, Jeremiah Milton, Amanda. Yeah, yeah. And but this he, is what happens when you let YouTubers come into boxing and dictate. Yeah, there's no way somebody who don't know shit about boxing should be able to have their own card that big and fuck up people's careers like that. He's a bitch. Get him to me and hurry up. And I'll fight the brother afterwards. Like that night, same night. I'll go back in the dressing room, put another outfit on, stretch out. The head, the so you right saying there. right now you would save the card, August 6th? Yeah, yeah. I'm at weight right now. He a dickhead, though. He a pussy. And of course he not. He not, he not going to fight. But I'm at weight. I'm five foot six, 200 pounds right now. I ain't fought in two years. Sometimes I smoke a little bud. I drink coffee. I drink liquor. I be having sex. Throughout the week. <laughs> I mean, I'm ready to go. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a late notice dream. Hit me up. Ryan. Just make sure the paper writes. You buying that pay per view? Absolutely. I'm going. I'm going. Ryan's going to be there. Ryan's part of the camp. Ryan's part of the camp. Yeah, Ryan's part of the camp. Rob part of the camp. I'm bringing everybody. Fuck that. I know what the oh, outcome is already. I'm we, want, we want 20 hotel rooms. And, you know, we'll talk about the money later. And the way I might don't make it happen in this motherfucker here. <laughs> what the fuck? Yeah, my you manager walking around. Right what you think, Al? I have a man in fact. What you think, Al? Jake Greg, Greg and Jake Paul. I like it. I like it. My manager said he like it. Yeah. The manager just Thumb. walked in. He Thumb. said, fuck it. Thumb allowing it to fuck up. <laughs> whatever he wanted that. He said whatever. he wanted right fuck now. It. Yeah, whatever he wanted. I'm on wait. It don't matter. He already on wait. Lying to the fuck out. This ain't no WWE. Nope. This ain't no motherfucking wrestling. Nope. As long as we wearing 10 ounce gloves, yeah. I'm showing love. I'm mm -hmm. love. <laughs> they set Rock Ron up though too, man. They knew they knew he wasn't gonna make that weight. That was his sparring partner. They knew, they knew he wasn't gonna make that weight. He, 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 he had to weigh a certain amount each week. Yo, who you know does? Who does like that weight? They weigh every week. Yeah, every bro. week he had to weigh in. They were trying to make sure he was coming down. And, and he had to lose it the right way. I mean, what the fuck they got to do with him losing his weight, bro? Twenty five percent of his first get cut for every like pound. For every pound. Weight. So the minimum was five grand. So the uh, same was like, oh, I still fight you for five grand. He was gonna knock him the yeah, fuck he out. Said, I take five thousand. You can take all the penalties. Yeah, I take five thousand. He was gonna beat Jake ass. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Jake Paul is pussy. <laughs> hey, what we yeah. gonna do? Jake, Jake Paul is pussy. He, he, said, he, he don't want no real boxing. He talking all that shit. You know what I mean? He want to. He, he want to fucking uh fucking. Yeah, yeah, you better keep doing what the fuck you're doing, nigga. You know what I mean? You keep playing these motherfucking yeah. games. That boy was on your ass. You know what I mean? <laughs> you talk all that shit. All you want keep pump faking. Nigga jump on your ass once you get in that ring, nigga. Yo, but look, all them YouTube fans ain't gonna help you. No. You can have about a million fucking followers all you want. Ain't none of them motherfuckers getting that ring with you. you know, fuck <laughs> so crazy. you better know what the fuck you doing. You asked for a real boxer, bitch. You better sit there and keep playing with the plan. What's crazy man. is the WBC was willing to rank him if he won. Yeah. How? It's all bullshit. How, bro? Yeah, it's all bullshit, but he, that's why he ain't jumped the fuck out there. Yeah, he fucked you know up. What I mean? Man. Yeah, he fuck crazy. Jump out there if he wants. Jump out the motherfucker here playing without a motherfucker parachute. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, stay in your place, man. Stay in your fucking Keep place. having fun. Yeah. This ain't fun, motherfucker. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you keep keep having fun. This ain't, this ain't Instagram. Yeah, I mean, this, this ain't fun right here. 
Motherfuckers already mad at you. You making all that fucking money in boxing. Niggas fighting. Niggas fighting all their life ain't getting that money. And Listen you playing up. with these Man, motherfuckers. Man, I'm at 200 right now. Yeah. yeah. Show him, show him. Hey, let's go. Hey. 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 I ain't giving them shit unless they send it. Yeah. 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 And we can rumble out here if you want. Y'all yeah. remember the oh, strip? Dying and sparring and everything. That's where it went down at over yeah. there? Dying and sparring. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dying and sparring. He made dying and He's up the hook. Do you think it was Jake people that pulled out of the fight realizing that the advantage that they had by bringing him down? Jake. Jake pulled it. He said, he said, oh, well, he won't fight this him. It was all, it was, it was all hype. You know what I mean? And then his people he told him, his like, people told him, listen, yo, you know what I mean? You might have fucked up. You know what I mean? Let's retract that shit and let's, 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 let's stop like playing like that. Like we, was play, we was playing too much. You know what I mean? They ain't laughing no more, getting too close. I knew Jake, shut that shit down. I knew yeah. Jake was a certified bitch when Yellow Beezy and them corny walked up on him. He was getting ready to start running. <laughs> it wasn't joking, Yeah, they, they just saying yeah, what's up with him. He getting ready to start running. Yeah. He not really about this shit. And then I, I get mad at I get mad at motherfuckers letting him troll the sport and, and troll the culture. Cause he put a he put a chain on, cool little outfit. They hanging with him in the club, all that. Don't don't get that boy no love, man. Send it, treat him like a dickhead, man. Get the fuck from around here. Cause it's motherfuckers who really putting in blood, sweat, and tears. You know what I mean for this shit, and he playing with it, and y'all making him think he cool. He's a bitch. Hey, like, get the fuck out of here. He should have fought Rock my Jr. anyway. Just cause. Why not fight him? Fuck the weight. Just fight him. You walking around like 220 anyway. You're regular, so you a heavyweight. You you call yourself trying to drain him out, and then you fuck the whole card up. And like you said, Brandon Lee's supposed to be on there. Mm -hmm. Serrano, you fuck they bag up. Real you motherfucking real fighters. Because you want to sit there and keep playing yeah, these fucking games. Yeah, you fucking people bad. You ain't no real fighter, motherfucker. You know yeah. what I mean? So stop yeah. keep playing like you're a real fucking yeah. fighter, man. This ain't all right. You know what I mean? What the fuck? Nigga, this ain't you too. Go, yeah, what you need to do, go to fucking wrestling with that fake shit. Yeah. All that shit like fake. His, brother. go to his wrestling. brother's wrestling now. Yeah, yeah, you, yeah. you would take over there with your bitch ass brother. Yeah. And y'all do the same thing. <laughs> Run the tag team. Yeah, go over there. Play, play with the motherfuckers over there. This shit ain't nothing to play with, man. No. Go over there, make the money. Do what you do. Have fun, man. That's what you do. Go over there, have fun with the, with the WWE, Ric Flair. Go ahead, dress up like Ric Flair, motherfucker. You got blind hair. Yeah. Fit the robe boy and yeah. get a new Ric Flair. Do that. Yeah. You know what I mean? And stay over there, man. Yeah. Stay the fuck out this boxing shit, man. Yeah. Don't play that shit. Yeah. Man. Yeah. 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 Yo. This shit different. I'm done. Yo, what was the time to hear that What was the what was the weight of Tommy uh, Tommy Fury supposed to be at? 200. I think two hundred cruiserweight, and that's what Tommy normally fight at. Tommy, yeah, yeah, but Tommy also had that other situation. But he knew Tommy was a hoe though, so that's that's the fight he really won. Yeah. Fuck Jake Paul. He won't fight Musa either. Yeah. Musa, that's it. He should have just filmed. Yeah. Right. Why not just film Musa casing in there? He was right same there. camp. Same team. Same bloodline. Yeah. Real fighters. Undefeated. Yeah. He ain't no trouble. That would make, to me, that would make sense. And I know Moose, is, Moose was in Kent, yeah. in Vegas. Yeah. And he looked like he was uh, he was around weight. Moose and fight at Cruiserweight. Yeah. I'm food away right now. I'm good. I'm ready to go. I got my team. I'm ready to go. Didn't you have a back and forth with BJ? His he trainer? Right. Yeah. He a bitch too. <laughs> Ain't he a freak? Ain't he a cheap ass <laughs> nigga too? He cheap as shit. We was in the club. My man Gabe. Gabe get a little sexy all that. He come over there trying to drink the drinks. Nigga, these ain't for you. Get your corny ass out of here. Then he got high and started running. Man, he doing all these freak ass dances. Yo, fuck BJ Flores too. He a bitch too. Ain't you a cheap corny ass nigga? And you ain't tip none of the waitresses, you corny ass nigga. You ain't put no money in on the bottles, you bitch ass nigga. <laughs> <laughs> you fucking nut. Get your bitch ass out of here. You fucking nut, bro. He was in there dancing like a fucking freak. So you should have seen him. Sick with him, sick too. Big That's fucking funny. Fuck him. <laughs> oh my god. Fuck him. You got a message specifically for Jake? Then y'all wait, turn everybody his back on. Greg had to be up in New York on the 5th. Weighing in. Rumble on the 6th. We know what it is.
<laughs> Send that paperwork. That's all. Hurry up, too. My lawyer, wait. I got everything already lined up. I'm waiting on them.